What's up guys, it's King Josh back with another video and today I'm going to show you guys the best big man dribble moves in NBA 2K20. For my dribble style, I tried out the slasher one, Paul George and Kawhi Leonard. I think Paul George one is the best, but if you end up not liking the Paul George dribble style, I would go with Kawhi Leonard. Next for the size up package, this one doesn't matter too much for big men, but I think normal 4 is the best and if you don't like this one, I would go with normal 3. For the moving crossover, I think normal 3 is the best one, as you can see by these animations right here. It does create a lot of space when you cross over. I'm kind of mad about this though because in NBA 2K19, normal 4 was really good, but they slowed it down a lot this year. They make you do an extra dribble before the crossover, so that makes the crossover really slow and hard to create space. But if you don't like normal 3, I would go with normal 2. But personally, I think normal 3 is the best moving crossover in the game for big men. Next, for behind the backs, I think normal 2 is the best. It's really fast, but if you don't like it, normal 3 is also really good. I think normal 3 creates a little bit more space because it flings you to the side instead of forward. But I like normal 2 because it is faster. When it comes to moving spins, I think basic 1 and normal 6 are the best. I'm kind of still trying them out, seeing which one I like better. Basic 1 has one spin that brings you back to the 3 point line, which I like a lot, but I haven't really mastered that yet, so it's kind of hard for me to do. But once I figure that out, I think I'll like basic 1 more. But if you don't plan on using that move, I would use normal 6 because it does have one really good animation. There it is, where you kind of spin back. It doesn't bring you back to the 3 point line, but it does create a lot of space. So I would go either basic 1 or normal 6 moving spin. For the basic hesitation, I like normal 2 because as you can see, it is super fast and normal 3 is also a good one. It is a little bit slower, but with normal 3, I'm pretty sure you can dribble out of the hesitation. So if you plan to do a move where you start the hesitation and then just dribble out, I would use normal 3. But other than that, I would use normal 2. It's really fast. Finally, for the triple threat styles, I use normal 5. Triple threat styles don't matter that much, but I actually do use triple threat moves like jab steps a lot. So that's going to be it for the dribble moves. If you guys want to see the rest of my animations and signature styles, make sure to get this video to 30 likes and I'll upload that. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to drop a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. It's been King Josh and I'm out. Peace.